Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm going to do a review on this Anchor USB-C charger, model number 726. This is their Nano 2 65 watt. It's got two USB-C ports on the front. This does fold in the back where you plug it in. Makes it really nice and collapsible. It's got the nice 65 watt logo on there. This just looks and feels really nice. I got a MacBook Air, I got a Samsung S22, and I got an iPhone. We're going to see how it charges all of them. Here's the different power outputs. So input, when you plug this in, you can plug it into 100 to 240 volts, 50 to 60 hertz. So the USB-C has a 5 volt 3 amps, 9 volt 3 amps, 15 volt 3 amps, and 20 volt 3.25 amps for the full 65 watts. It also has PPS 3.3 volts at 16 to 16 volts equals 3.25 amps. And then when you go to two ports, one USB-C one goes down to five volts, three amps, nine volt, three amps, 15 volts, three amps, 20 volts, 2.25 amps for 45 watt max. Okay, so first let's charge the MacBook. Let's plug it into, let's just have one USB-C port. Let's check the MacBook, see how much it's charging. Okay, so my MacBook Air, it's an M1. It's charging at 65 watts. Okay, so let's plug my Samsung S22 in. Now the Samsung S22 is super fast charging now. We can see that on the phone, it went to super fast charging, but the MacBook Air did drop down to 20 watts. Okay, so I've got my iPhone 13 Pro plugged in now. Now, as long as you've got more than 20 watts output, this will be fast charging. So the iPhone is fast charging, but the MacBook Air stayed at 20 watts. So the MacBook Air will still charge at that rate. It'll just be quite a bit slower. The 65 watts will really get that MacBook Air charged up really quick. Your iPhone is going to charge really quick, even if only one or two things are plugged into it. So even when it's charging the MacBook and the iPhone, this thing never gets really super hot. Um, it gets just a little bit warm to the touch, but it does a really good job. I like that it has two output ports. You do get this, the only time you get the full 65 watts is when only one port is being used. I hope the video helps. Thanks everybody for watching.